anything we post, we can prove. We can back it up. Geoengineeringwatch.org is a data repository. We're non-political. We simply want to have the most credible site possible for people to draw upon to help wake others up. The site was started in 2009 and we are now experiencing about 20,000 to 25,000 visitors a day. What I have tried to do at geoengineeringwatch.org and tried to encourage other very committed activists to do is to utilize the science terms when trying to convey this issue to others so that when people search this issue online, when they look for data, they find solid, credible science data and not conspiracy theory and hoax. Thus, semantics matter. If we use the science terms, climate engineering, geoengineering, solar radiation management, stratospheric aerosol injection, if we know and use the science terms, people will search and find science data. When people use the term chemtrails, which many people are bent on using that term, certainly it's a descriptive term, but it is a non-science term that by design leads people to definitions of conspiracy theory and hoax, and that's as far as most people get. What I've tried to do, and with the help of other activists that also see the merit in, in taking that science approach, is to gain credibility, and credibility that's necessary to build bridges with those from the climate science community who know this is going on, but are afraid to speak out and certainly afraid to associate with any other groups or movements that are not standing on solid science.